Okay, guys, you're going to have to excuse the kitchen. It's a mess. <laughs> anyway, this is the dip. Uh, it's not very bad at all. Anyway. I had to take the cabinet down up here. It was uh, too high. And uh, so excited. It, anyway, that's what I've been using. This is the, I've been using this as a refrigerator since the flood. And look inside. Like I said, I don't have it plugged in yet. And uh, there's the handles. And uh, the ass maker. And it has glass shelves. So that's pretty cool. They did have another one that the ice maker was completely on the door. So there was a, a shelves all the way down. But I'm awfully close. I can't get a full picture of it. But I'm excited. This is where the other the cabinet was. Oh, I had to take it down. So So it's pretty cool. I hadn't had a new refrigerator in 18 years probably. Because I didn't. Anyway. I just saw this chair. I'm so excited. I'm so excited about these glass. I always, I've never liked the wire. The stuff won't set straight on there. Things fall through it. And these are all glass. They feel like glass. What, whatever they're made of. Plastic glass. It's better than wire frames. And uh, my old icebox had two of these. This one only has one. And I don't know if it's missing or, yeah. And uh, so. So, we'll see. This does have three drawers, I guess. Yeah. Anyway, okay guys, well, I will uh, say good night and unpack this baby and plug her in and see if she works. <laughs> okay guys, send all my love and my hugs. This is Lisa with the Barnyard Chicken. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. This is a whirlpool. Anyway, if you've ever had a, well, I don't know if you can see that. Have you ever had a Whirlpool? This is my first Whirlpool refrigerator. I mean, I did have the Whirlpool. Um, like I said, I wanted black, but this one's gray. And this color. It's not chrome. And it's not chrome. Because the magnet sticks to it. Magnets do not stick to chrome. See? It's pretty good. It sticks pretty good, too. Anyway. Got oil on my finger again. I, something in there's got oil on it. Anyway, I'm just dawdling now. Please leave a comment about your experiences with Whirlpool. And, um, this is my first experience, so we'll see. Alright, I am out of here. Please like, subscribe, and comment.